All right, time to play some more Star Wars Squadrons. Oops, I don't want to restart the story. We are on mission 13, Fire in the Heart. So we just read up here. The New Republic is pinned down near Galatan. The damaged Starhawk is in your sights, defended by Anvil Squadron and the traitor Lyndon Javes. Complete your mission. Eliminate the Starhawk and Lyndon Javes. So I guess we're playing as the Empire now? All right, cool. Let's do that. Let it load. Okay. We'll transition there. Oh, here we go. Anybody else I need to talk to? Nope. When I was a police officer on Parkella, I'd spend weeks fighting red tape to arrest a racketeer or a slaver gang. People who were obviously guilty. I enlisted with the Empire because it gave me the power to do what was necessary. Deliver justice to the galaxy. Flying ties is more dangerous than chasing crooks. Every time I fly out of this hangar, I know it could be my last. But I come back. Time and again. I'm so tired of arguments about Imperial morality. I've heard pilots question our empire. They wonder if our methods were right. But they always forget one thing. The simple fact is this. We have the power, so we have determined what is right. When you're out there, Never forget that you get to decide who lives and who dies. You've earned that power. Let's go. The captain is waiting. All right, cool. <laughs> Let's move on. Get to the briefing. We've done it. With Vanguard Squadron backed into a corner, Lyndon Javes has made his last mistake. We have confirmation that Lyndon has joined the fray. That's not all. He's leading the same rebel squadron we decimated at Moncala. This is a calculated move. Lyndon wants me to do something reckless. He thinks he knows me. But he's wrong. We're not going to take the bait. Titan Squadron will focus on our real target. The Starhawk. Admiral Sloan is counting on us. I wish I could deal with Lyndon personally. But a commander's true weapon is a squadron, not a starfighter. Go. Complete your mission. And if you get Lyndon in your sights, strike him down once and for all. This is it, Titan Squadron. Our moment of victory is at hand. The Temperance has broken off from the Rebel fleet, but no matter. Our focus is the Starhawk. And thanks to the reinforcements from Admiral Sloan, we now have it surrounded. The Starhawk suffered catastrophic damage from our Baradium assault and has had no opportunity for repairs. If I'm correct, a careful strike to the ship's tractor beam core should turn it into a floating time bomb. Reaching the Starhawk will not be easy. The rebels managed to call in reinforcements of their own. Anvil Squadron, to be precise. Lyndon Javes is handling Anvil Squadron's tactics personally. Anvil took heavy losses at Moncala, but they still have starfighters and a grudge. Destroy them. They're also fielding a Nebulon B frigate. We have a raider on hand to assist you. Once you reach the Starhawk, you must breach its armor to attack the core. Scans indicate there's an undetonated Baradium missile lodged somewhere in the Starhawk's hull. Exploit that. With the hull breached, a single fighter can fly inside the Starhawk to attack its tractor beam core. We have no idea what to expect on the inside. Do what you must to start a core overload and then escape to the Overseer while there's still time. All our work and sacrifice has led to this. Titan, 
Do not let Lyndon Jave stop you now. This is it. Destroying that Starhawk makes us heroes. And heroes have influence. A smart person could parlay that influence. Become Admiral Sloane's aide, perhaps. Once in the heart of Imperial power, you can guide it. From there, anything's possible. Even the foundations of a new Senate. Now all we have to do is win. Oh, don't worry. I'm not losing sight of what we must do. But this is about more than ending a war. A true future for the Empire. Beyond Death Stars and Rebels is within our grasp. That is what I'm fighting for. Whatever you're fighting for, remember it today. Captain, I would be remiss if I didn't point out that our odds of success are substantially lower than usual. Are you saying Titan Squadron is no match for a broken-down rebel fleet? Oh, uh, no, not at all. Your record is very impressive. It's just that these rebels are desperate. That makes them especially dangerous. Hmm. A valid observation, LT-514. I expect you will keep it in mind. I took this pasting to see how squadron tactics really work in the field, and I discovered how little I really knew. But now I have enough material to submit an entire intelligence data bank on Titan Squadron, and yourself in particular. Watching you hunt rebels has been very educational, and rather fun. Thank you. It's been an honor to observe. You've made yourself indispensable. Titan Squadron would not have been the same without you. When I called you to serve, you answered without hesitation. I won't forget it. The battle is waiting. Do not disappoint me. All right, let's go to the hangar. Uh, let's see, we got people to talk to, okay. Anvil Squadron makes no difference. Once the Starhawk is gone, we'll be one step closer to ending this war. But the end of the war doesn't mean the end of our duty, does it? Captain Carroll may be satisfied with destroying the Starhawk, but it's only one ship. Enemies of the Empire exist all across the galaxy. I'll deal with them myself if I have to. Sounds like a good retirement to me. Let's finish this. goes on. Didn't stop at Endor. Won't end with a Starhawk. Whatever's destroyed rises again. I've lived it. They need soldiers, pilots. Always have. Always will. Rebels or Republic. We know our duty. Take strength in that. You fly. I'll follow. <clears throat> okay. Well, nobody else to talk to? All right. This is it then. Captain Carroll needs you in a TIE fighter, bomber, or interceptor. Your choice. All right, so I got a choice. Uh, I like the interceptor. Let me check out what kind of stuff we got here. Nah. Can hold on. Hmm. I might do that. Repair system. Pretty good. Uh concussion missile. No, no shield. Uh homing dumb fire weapon. No. Lock required. Huh. You know what? I'll just stick with the uh, regular auxiliary. And we don't have a capital ship to protect, so I'll just get the Seeker Warheads. I will uh, add a little bit more 
hull. And um, let's see. Boost charge, max speed. Hmm. Maneuverability. Slower max speed and acceleration. But with faster turns. Uh. Yeah, I'll try that one. All right. Ready to go. A little bit of loading. Ah, there we go. Is ready. On your order, Captain. I've come to expect nothing less. The Star Hawk is straight ahead, but you will have to cut through the Republic fleet to reach it. Overseer to Imperial Raider. Help Titan break through the Republic lines. Yes, ma'am. Moving to position. Heads up! Incoming fighters! Titan, destroy those fighters now. Anvil leader to Titan. You should have wiped us out of Moncala. Thanks for the second chance. And if you're looking for me, Teresa, I'll just be over here with the rest of that. Taking out this Star Destroyer. Shame you won't come face me. Traitor! How dare you talk to us about shame! Titan is my weapon. Poised to deliver the Empire's vengeance. Right. Anvil leader, when you're finished there, come join us. Anvil dies today. We have to clear those fighters. Got him. Nice shot. I got him, I got him. Wasted my missile on that. I got him, I got him. He's right there, I see him. He's in my sights. Ah, <laughs> I got him. Couple more. No mercy. One more. I want that gone. All fighters destroyed. Good. Now focus on that frigate. Radar here. Moving to support. 
Titan Squadron. These were public fools, trapped, outnumbered, and they refused to accept it. They'll call us weak, even as the might of our empire sweeps them aside. Your primary target is the enemy frigate. I'm on your wing. Come on, come on, get out of there, come on. A little drift. And then we're gonna line up for another attack run. Come on, we gotta take this guy out. Oh, there we go. Launching missiles. Almost dead. Shoot the enemy. Sorry, he got in my way, man. Come on. Alright, almost there. Almost there, 12 health left. Three health left. Guys, attack, attack, attack. Nice. Good job. Countermeasures, countermeasures. Nice. 
Nice. Attack, attack, attack. Fences. Shields are gone. Come on. Another attack run. Close there. And then my missile's ready. Alright, here we go. Should be exploding. Ugh, there we go. Got him. Another Corvette. front right this is the rear so we need to go around the front Get in this hole. Ooh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Slightly inside. Ooh. Look, just get to the core and watch out for gravitational anomalies. 
Use your boost thrusters if you need to. But remember, the tight space will make that tricky. Don't forget to give yourself room to decelerate. Commander, a Titan Starfighter just breached the Starhawks hull. They're inside. Oh, man. Copy and go leader. Oops. Ow. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Reach out from checkpoint. Oops. If you need to. But remember, the tight space will make that tricky. Engine, engine. Don't forget to give yourself room to decelerate. Commander, a Titan Starfighter just Oops, breached the storm. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Copy and go leader. Teresa, what are you up to? I'm finishing what I began at the Deary. Oh, come on. Gotta do some tight flying in here. Across here, might need to cut up here. Whoops! Push through. Ah. Use your boost thrusters if you have to. I want to do that. <laughs> I did that last time. I almost died. Oh, well, I did die. So. Tank three, throttle down. I'm reading strange gravity effects inside that core. Whoops! 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 Okay. I'll focus on that one a little bit. Just a little more. Come on. Where's that last one? There it is. Yes, core it. Wait. Uh oh. Calculations show the core is about to release a gravity burst. Titan three. That burst will fire you out of the core like a blaster bolt. Center yourself with the entrance. You can ride the shockwave out. It might be tricky. Relax, stay nimble, and steer clear of the walls. Okay. <laughs> gravity burst incoming. Steer carefully. The gravity fluctuations might knock you off course. Titan three, brace yourself. Oops. Ah, God. No. <laughs> I died. All right, I'll do that again. You should be close to the core's emitters. Zero in and fire. Stay away from the center. Reading a spike at the core. Keep going. Half the emitters are offline. <laughs> okay, well, I'll try it again one more time. Steer carefully. The gravity fluctuations might knock you off course. Titan 3, brace yourself. Titan 3 is clear. You did it. The Starhawk's core has become a time bomb. Nothing can stop it from overloading now. Star Destroyer down. More of our people saved. And we're just getting started. And with me. Yes, sir. It's time to end this. Don't you dare fight James without me. You'll have to go through us first. Titan 3, we're pinned down. It's in your hands now. Titan 3. I gave you 
a chance at Fostar Haven. I wish you'd taken it. Yeah, they're on my back. Where's the rest of my squad? <laughs> I'm gonna take these guys out. Hold on, just a second. Getting annoying right here. Hey, let's make this a fair fight. Come on. Got like five against one here. Oh, no. This guy is just getting a little... Ah, man. Where are you? Come on. Oh, man, I am out of... Uh...
<laughs> yeah, this is not this is not the the way to do things. Okay, all right. Oh, I don't have any countermeasures. Titan Squadron, with Admiral Sloan's unerring support, we have left Project Starhawk in ruins. Vanguard Squadron is doomed. Imperial ideals have prevailed. Loyalty, duty, discipline. And with our latest champion, we shall ascend to even greater heights. Titan III has been promoted to Flight Baron, with full honors. Well done. Your future with the Empire is bright. I take pride that the death of Lyndon Javes sends a message to all who would betray us. That wherever the enemies of the Empire may arise, Titan will be waiting, no matter the cost. This war is our crucible. We will emerge triumphant and bring this new republic 
to its knees. Okay, cool. Let me just uh, see what the requirements are for these medals. 18 minutes or less. I died several times. Ooh, shot down the traitor while maintaining 50% hull integrity or higher. Reached the Starhawk's core in 40 seconds without taking damage. And uh, yeah, I got the uh, completed all the Imperial, uh, Imperial missions. All right, let's just go to the main menu. That was a pretty long one, but uh, I think that is pretty much it for today. Oops. Uh, wait a minute, where did my mouse cursor go? There it is. All right, well, like I said, that's about it for today. And, uh, yeah, actually, let me just check something. Aha, uh -huh, okay, that'll be for next time. Because this, this has been a little too long. So, yep, I will see you guys next time. Oh, no, come on. Where's my mouse? I really hate this game sometimes.